Hi guys, so welcome to, I think it's episode 9, I think, um, of my 1.16 Let's Play. Um, so in the last episode, I think we did the mine um, down here. So that goes all the way down to Y12 where we can get diamonds. And we also found some iron to boost up our gear. So I'm just going to grab that now and I'm going to craft it up. Right, so we can have, uh, we have that, hang on, I need to put some stuff down, okay, we can have an iron sword, boom, an iron axe, boom, an iron shovel, boom, and an iron hoe. Or is it? Boom. And then we can have a bucket. I just need to put a bit more stuff in my chest. And I'll keep those on me. So today I'm just going to do a small amount of mining just to start it off. And then I think maybe I'll do a bit more on my base. So let's get into this mining. Okay, so we're going to start a strip mine. And that literally just means you mine in a strip. So you just keep going. Oh, iron already. So you just keep going until you get some good stuff. I'll just do about like a few minutes, but I'm going to time lapse it, so. And then you want to put torches along the walls. Oh, iron. You want to put some torches along the walls just to light it up and so you can see which direction you're going because the ones on the left go on the left. Oh, some redstone. So you can use this to make like contraptions. They're quite hard to make, and I will try and make some later on, but for the moment, they're quite hard. Iron shovel. Right. Do you hear that? I'll be fine. Gravel is so annoying. Yeah, um, so in Minecraft, there are a few different, like, falling blocks. And they're blocks that, like, fall. Well, the name's pretty self-explanatory. And one of the tricks for mining them... There's no point now. Um, you've got to, um, there's no point on this stack, but you've got to break the bottom one and you've got to put a torch. You've got to put a torch underneath the next one. It's really hard. I'm just not going to bother trying because um, when a falling block falls on a torch, uh, did I see lava? I think I may have found that skeleton. I'm so gonna die. Quite a nice big cave though. There's some iron. I'm gonna see if there are any diamonds down here. Wait, I need to be a bit lower for the diamonds. So. I still love doing that. Okay, um, I don't think there are any. I'm just not going to risk dying. 
I'm gonna head back to my little strip mine. Up this way. Okay, there's some coal. I can grab that later. Oh, I'm gonna grab the iron though. Because you never know when you'll need a bit more. And I could make some armor or something. You know what? Did I make a bucket in the end? I must have dropped it. Oh, come on. Um, because if I could, I would have grabbed up some of that lava and it would have helped me to make uh, the nether portal I've been talking about. I'd need quite a lot though to do it. If I find an underground lava pool, that would be the best, but... I'll take the coal. Yeah, this is how boring it is actually mining. You just gotta keep going. Oh, I nearly fell in that. That's an underground lava pool. Never here we come. Right, we're going to the nether this episode. Yes, 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 and yes. And I'm gonna time lapse me going up again. Oh, this is brilliant. I'm going to cut this bit out whilst the iron's cooking. Okay, so I just um, cut to when the iron finished cooking, um, just because it took a while and was really boring. Um, there's still two in there, but I've got enough to make some, like exactly enough to make some buckets. So I'm gonna make these buckets up, and then I'm gonna go down into this mine I have and fill them up. Hang on, I'm just gonna do something useful first. I need one of those. And I'm gonna go down into this mine Oh, there was a ladder there, sorry, I forgot. I'm going to go down into the mine. And I'm going to go and gather up some of the lava. And I'm going to bring it up to the surface. And then I can build the nether portal by... When lava gets hit by water, the lava disappears and turns into obsidian. And you need obsidian for the nether portal. So I'm going to then... Yeah, turn the lava into obsidian where are my buckets and i'm also putting a hole here so i will be able to jump down once i've got rid of those ladders instead of having to climb all the way down i'll just be able to like bungee jump down okay i have I have five lava buckets. I can always go back and get more if I don't have enough. Okay, just need to climb back up. Can't wait till I've got a water elevator. Right, I'm gonna put it here for now because I'll be able to break it once I've got diamonds. Then you dig two blocks down. 
You put lava. Then you go boom. Then you put lava and you go boom. And then you break those blocks. And then you need the rest of the lava. Okay, I'm going to need to go and grab more of the um, lava. But... I need one, two, three, four, five more buckets of lava. And I have five buckets, okay. Okay, uh, I won't go into the nether this episode, but I'll have the portal up. So next episode, in we go. Into the doom world. I'm just gonna break these ladders so I can actually jump down next time. Because if you fall and hit ladders, even though they're ladders, you still take full damage if you hit them dead on from the top. But if you fall down the side, you can grab onto them and not take the full damage. So now, boom, I can fall straight in. Now, hopefully there's enough lava left. I think there'll be five blip, blip, bits, bits left. There's probably some diamonds here too. Okay. Yes, there's five left. And uh, there's probably diamonds there, so... I can probably grab those some other time if they are there. Because that's generally the place where you find diamonds in caves, next to like lava pools and things. But I have the five things I need. Ah... Which means I can make up the portal and then I will have the nether, well not really unlocked. I should have two left. Do I? Yes, I do. Okay, never here we come. Right, this is the hardest bit. I always get it wrong. You've got to go there. Then there, and you go... Nope. Nope, 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 nope. No! Oh! Come on, I've got to go back down to get another bit. And this is why we got this. Oh, I was so close. Just messed up. I do have another bit, thankfully. Thankfully I did have that other bit down in that pool. If I hadn't, oh, that would have been so annoying if I hadn't. Oh, I really need to get some faster way up sorted. In the comments, tell me if you know any like cool tutorials on how to make faster ways up. I know about a soul sand bubble elevator, but like any cool piston. Oh my gosh! So to make to go into the Nether, you need a frame, um, two blocks. So the inside needs to be a three by two area, and so you don't need to have the corners on the frame. You just need the sides. Then. You light it with flint and steel. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Okay. We actually have another portal. Right, and then to put out another portal. Oh, hello. 
these guys spawn in the nether, but they can come through your portal. He used to be a zombie pig man, but now he's a zombified piglin because of the new nether update. Oh, he's back. He's back through. So that's just a little taster of the nether for next episode. So if you really enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one when we go through. Goodbye. Am I going? No, I'm not.